Good day, everyone. My name is King Joshua Oligario Milagrosa from BSc E4C Compre Subject. So today I will be discussing to you about sample problem about collapse mechanism. For a sample problem, so determine the plastic moment MP using the virtual work method and the uniformly distributed load W U. So for our figure, we have here a beam which is um, fixed at both sides. So may nag-a-act dyan na 20 kN na load. So yung span ng beam natin is uh, 10 meter. So for the collapse mechanism, so since yung beam natin is both fixed and so yung magiging plus uh, yung magiging uh, point niyan dito sa dulo-dulo ng beam is plastic hinge then kapag nag deflect naman siya so yung displacement sa gitna so ang magiging point din yan is plastic hinge so uh, for a theta or for a angle since equal naman siya Kasi sa gitna naman nag a load. So, theta and theta yung both side niya. Then, pag in-extend naman natin tung line na to, so here, magkakaroon tayo ng 2 theta. Since, pag pre-project pre lang natin yan, or naglagay tayo dito ng line. So, ayan, ang invisible line. So, etong theta na to is equal lang din sa theta dito. So, itong theta dito, equal sa theta dito. So, theta plus theta is equal to 2 theta. Kaya, 2 theta yung naan dito. So, so for, ano, for plastic moment, so, isosolve natin siya using the external work done, which is equal to internal work done. So, for our external work done, so, equal yan sa PY. And then, for our internal work done, equal yan sa MP or yung plastic moment multiplied by the um, angles or thetas, summation of thetas. So, for our PY or yung, yung height nung uh, beam mula sa deflection niya, so, equal yan sa... Uh, by using Pythagorean theorem, so equal yan sa tangent theta is equal to y over 5. So since ito yung theta natin, so we have here the opposite and the adjacent. So kaya y over 5. So according dun sa may ano, sa small angle theory, yung sine theta is equal yan sa tangent theta which is equal to Theta. So, bali, si tangent theta is equal yan sa theta. So, palitan lang natin ng theta. Then, equal to y over 5. Then, uh, ilipat lang natin si 5 or i-multiply natin si 5 dito sa theta. So, bali, y or yung height is equal to 5 theta. So, by substitution, so... Yung P natin or yung load natin is 20 kN. Ito. Multiply lang natin sa Y or yung height which is equal to 5 theta. Is equal yan sa um, MP times uh, 4 theta. So, theta plus theta plus 2 theta is equal to 4 theta MP. So, 20 times 5 is equal to 100 theta is equal to 4 theta MP. Then, divide both sides by 4 theta. Then, makukuha natin MP or plastic moment is equal yan sa um, 25 kN meter. Then, going naman tayo dun sa may uniformly distributed load. So, para makuha natin siya, same lang din, si internal work done is equal yan sa external work done. So, since gaya dun sa may plastic moment natin, si internal work done is equal sa MP multiplied or times the summation of thetas. Then, dito naman, yung work uh, or yung external work done naman dito is equal na yan sa 
WU or sa uniformly distributed load since yun yung hinahanap natin, i-multiply naman na natin siya sa may area ng triangle na to. So here. Yan. So alam natin that the area of a triangle is equal yan sa 1 half base ng height. So by substitution, so 4 theta mp is equal yan sa WU multiplied by 1 half ng base which is yung span ng beam which is 5 meter. Uh, I, I'm sorry, it's 10 meter which is 5 plus 5. Then multiply natin sa height which is equal dun sa 5 theta na na-compute natin kanina. So, uh, pag sinod natin yan, so 4 theta mp is equal to W theta. So, 1 half times 10 times 5 is equal yan sa 25 theta. So, by substituting 25 kilonewton to mp, here mp, then yung makukuha nating WU is equal na yan sa 4 theta times 25 kilonewton meter all over 25 theta. So, cancel out na tong 25 and then yung theta. Then, so, yung makukuha natin uniformly distributed load is equal yan sa 4 kilonewton per meter. So, that's it for today.